Welcome to another vlog where you get to be with me, Bree. Tonight, because it is night, I am going to a birthday party and, um, oh yeah, happy new year. Like, how rude of me. Happy new year. I hope you guys had a great, great new year and, you know, getting off to a great start. I am going to a birthday party. So I'm just so I'm just about to do my makeup. Party starts at 8:30. It is six seven well six six forty five. My friend is coming to scoop me up. So I'm just about to do my makeup real quick. Thank you if you did tune in to Vlogmas. Ugh, Vlogmas almost took me out, y'all. I don't know if I'm doing Vlogmas again. If I do, it'll be like every other day or or maybe I'll do something in November. But Vlogmas is just a lot. And I feel like you work your behind off just for you to get no views because of course it's a lot of content everybody's doing vlogmas and everybody has things to watch so you know it's just kind of difficult i think if you don't already have like a really strong following then you know vlogmas just isn't the tea for you um and i love you guys i love the ones that did support but i don't have like such a strong audience any well right now so you know vlogmas may not be it for me this year hopefully we can get to 100k wishful thinking wild thinking i'm saying it out loud and i'm just gonna put in the work this year so we will see what god has in store the last like last week or so it got really really cold here in atlanta and y'all it was in shambles pipes were bursting all over atlanta it was just i had a pipe burst in my apartment and i'll insert that clip here i literally thought i was gonna have to go back to florida because my nerves are just too bad for foolishness and i was like oh no i can't i just can't like i can't be a part of this this is not my ministry. I did not move to Atlanta for this. So yeah, that happened. But thank goodness it warmed up and everything calmed down. So things are pretty much back to normal at this point. But winter isn't over. So hopefully they address the issue and try to get things under control because all the pipes busting and stuff, I just cannot. That is beyond me and... I will quickly remove myself because I don't have time. I just don't. So, yeah, that's what's been going on, y'all. So, I'm just going to finish getting dressed. And I'll probably take you guys along with me to the party. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, this is the finished look. I have on this real cute dress, cute dress, just this little jacket with these heels. I love everything. I don't know if I'm going to bring my camera, but I'll definitely vlog on my phone if I don't bring my camera. But yeah, I'm about to head out. And then I 
y'all pour me up some drops. Y'all said rich free nigga, y'all ain't on no block. was a lit we had a time last night and it was just good to see the girls so today i am going to the store i need to return something to or exchange something at bath and body works and uh what else i need to exchange something i want to pick up some curtains and a rod from target because i kind of want to get this little area together so i'm gonna show y'all y'all already have seen like this area so this living room area i'm thinking i want to put a curtain here because i want to start doing like outfit of the day photos and as you can see my kitchen is right there i would like it if you couldn't see that kitchen part and it's just all white and I think that'll be super cute. And then also I want to start doing like my try on hauls. So of course I'll do it here. I want kind of to like have a cat corner. So I want the curtain to kind of be here. I can have my pompous and then I want to have a rack. So I'm going to get a rack as well. I'm going to look in Target to see what kind of racks they have or whatever. So I'm going to put the rack here and yeah, I just kind of want to get more into the fashion mode and I feel like the curtain will kind of divide the spaces. Also, um, I think the curtains would be cute just for like this area. If I want to sit and talk, I can have like a chair here and then the curtains and then you can see the sign. So that's kind of like what I'm going for. I just want to have like a more luxe look for my videos and just content and things like that i need to finish taking down christmas decorations but yeah um that's the game plan so i'm gonna take you guys to a couple stores with me and see what we can find so let's go fact about me i love just driving and vibing out and listening to music so i came to this bath and body works that's like 25 minutes from me just because the weather cleared up and it's just really nice and i also wanted to go to like an outside bath and body works because i don't like going to the mall so the only other outside bath and body works that's by me is atlantic station and it's just a little, I'm used to Atlantic Station. I just wanted to go somewhere different. So I came here <clears throat> and it's gorgeous, you guys. Gorgeous. It's a sign that says Peach Tree Corners and it's just beautiful out here. It looks like whimsical, like Harry Potter, kind of, but also like whimsical Christmas town, sort of, kind of. It's just so pretty. So I went into Bath and Body Works. I exchanged what I needed to. And now we're going to Target. I would have came out earlier, but it was raining. And now it's just the most gorgeous day ever. Like, wow. So I need a new shower caddy. It's $10, only one more. But I want one that's rust proof. It says that it's rust resistant, but I don't believe them. 
I don't know and it's so cute but I also need another a water filter and a new shower head so I don't know if I should get this one I might get it so maybe I'll get it hmm shower heads but these are ugly I'll probably order mine off of Amazon yeah because these aren't cute I also need, no, those are shower rods. Shower rods. No, I need a curtain. Curtain rod. yesterday so um today is thursday or something like that y'all i am a pilates girl as you can see i'm on my pilates reformer machine okay my legs hurt but i absolutely love it this is my second day on my pilates machine and i just know that you know it's it's here in my house so i'll be looking at it it'll be reminding me like you need to work out it's such a good workout i do sweat i don't sweat as much because i only do 30 minutes but of course the more i get used to it the longer i'll go i do want to get used to it because i want to start a youtube channel i feel like that'll um be great just for you know the girlies that want to do pilates at home and actually get a machine and they may want like a quick 30 minute routine or something i'm still trying to get it down so once i get it down then i'm gonna start the youtube channel but yeah i'm in love i love pilates pilates is for me like pilates is that girl and i hate working out but pilates in my house i can sit here look at my view I can do my little workout at home and just go on about my day. So I'm absolutely in love. And I'll keep you guys updated on this Pilates journey, of course. But today, um, I got the curtain rod and the shower caddy from Target, like I showed you guys. So today I'm going to Ikea and I'm taking you guys with me. I'm actually going to get some curtains because I believe I got these curtains from Ikea. And so I want to get curtains to kind of go here because... When I start my Pilates videos, I just want like a cute little backdrop, like a just white backdrop. So hopefully that can work out. We'll see. And then also, um, I have a mirror here that I want to start doing like outfit of the days in. And I don't want my kitchen to be in the, the pictures. And then also, if I'm doing like anything at my vanity, I want the curtains. And I just think it'll be cute even for my Wickfall Styles um, content. You know, I can kind of bust out the curtain. And just, I, I just think it'll be a vibe. So I'm willing to try and see how it goes. So we're going to go to Ikea. I'm also going to see if Ikea has shower heads. And I'm kind of looking for a mirror to go over my TV. Let me write this stuff down. Because I be forgetting shower head mirror. And I seen one at Home Goods, but it was a bit pricey. So we're going to look at ikea shower head i need to also get a shower filter shower water filter i don't know if ikea has those but if not i'll go to home depot or lowe's oh curtains and i think that's it hey babes so today is the next day i didn't end up finding any curtains or anything um i got up this morning though and i got 
me show you guys what I got. This shower head from Lowe's. It's just this brass, like detachable shower head to match the gold caddy that I got from Target. Not sure if it quite matches, but we're gonna roll with it. Um, I did end up getting my <clears throat> I did end up getting my wardrobe from my clothing rack from IKEA. So I'm just gonna leave these house projects right here where they are because you know I'll need to finish getting everything together. And um yeah, I kind of want to wait until I have everything to get things together. So today was such a beautiful day. Um, the sun is actually about to go down. It's 527, but I've just been working on my project management class because I am considering being a corporate hottie because these entrepreneurial streets are just beyond me at this point. So, you know, we'll see. I'll take you guys along that process if you guys are interested. But yeah, so right now, now that I'm done with that, I'm going to tackle this. So I'm actually going to do my mannequin's makeup because I haven't done her face in about two years. Like she's had the same makeup. So I'm just going to do her some makeup and kind of do like inventory, figure out what I want to do with my wig business this year if I just want to have a sale and sell out and just be done with it or do I want to continue um I love doing what I do I love doing hair I do want to continue but it's just hard everything's expensive um it's just a lot but you know I really do feel like this is what I'm meant to do like make wigs and you know just be in the hair industry in some realm so I'm gonna continue for right now but I just want to play things smart and <clears throat> kind of figure out where I want to go with it so yeah I'm about to just do some content for my wig business and I post that on TikTok and Instagram and stuff probably tomorrow but yeah, we're just going to do some inventory and everything. But I think that's it for this vlog, you guys. I've just been trying to get things together. Things have not been like falling into place like I want them to. As far as me finding the curtains and finding um, the water filter that I need. I'm going to have to order them online. So I'm going to have to wait until those come. So yeah, I'll definitely show you guys that in the next vlog. But... For right now, I'll just show you guys um, a little BTS of me working on the business. And I will see you guys in the next vlog. So some kind of projects I have for this area is I want to put some lights here on those top two shelves. So it can kind of shine down on the sign and um, just be really cute. I want to get some more units um hopefully i can fill those four on the two sides and yeah give my girl there in the middle a makeover and see what inventory we have i have some wigs there and i have wigs under here so we're just gonna get that together so happy new year thank you guys so much for tuning in watching supporting i love you guys so much and i hope you all are enjoying the vlogs but yeah, we're just going to do some work and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Before I go, I want to share one of my goals for 2023 and that's to pace myself and not burn out. I was working on my class and I said I would do a week's work every day so I can finish before January. And sometimes I'll finish and want to keep going and I have to remind myself to stop so I won't get burnt out for the next day. Consistency is better than rushing because you'll be eager to show up every single day. And that's what I need to focus on moving forward. Love you guys. Happy New Year.